Hi guys, my name is Bjorn and welcome to Gilmersh. Today we're going to talk about a pedal that's been out for a few months already, but it's been one of my favorite overdrive distortion pedals this summer. This is the uh, BLD from uh, Past Effects. I'm going to show you some of my favorite tones and we're going to look into the versatility of this uh, fantastic sounding pedal. So stick around. <laughs> BLD is a clone of the classic TC Electronic Booster, Line Driver and Distortion pedal that was uh, released in the early 80s, I think. The original was a hugely popular uh, distortion and it's, it's considered to be a classic distortion. The BLD, as with many uh, past effects pedals, are expanding on the original circuit with uh, new features and uh, also a few upgrades. David Gilmore used the pedal in uh, um, in 87, 88, 89 on his uh, momentary lapse of reason delicate sound of thunder stage rig. Now it's not known on which songs he used the pedal. I asked uh, Kit Ray who's um, much more knowledgeable of this era than I am and um, although he couldn't pin down on uh, exactly which songs it was used on he guessed uh, Dogs of War which I, I tend to agree on and possibly a few others using the bo boost function. If you haven't be sure to, to visit uh, Kit Ray's uh, fantastic uh, Big Muff uh, page uh, covering everything you need to know about Big Muffs. It really doesn't matter how uh, or or uh, if David Gilmore used the pedal. It was a part of his his um, 80s uh, rig and and probably uh, a significant uh, pedal in the early stages of the uh, 87 tour um, together with um, the Boss HM2 and the, the Big Muff uh, and all of these had uh, assigned uh, yeah, EQs and uh, but, but what I hear is the 80s uh, the, the BLD sort of reminds me of uh, a rat, a rock man, a cranked marshal and it sounds just amazing with a bit of chorus and, and delay as well it's a very natural sounding uh, distortion and um, a bit of uh, mid-range and compression going on uh, but but the, the the big thing about this pedal is that it has a noise gate uh, and while the original didn't work that well I think uh, this clone from Past Effects has a really, really dynamic noise uh, noise gate that allows the, the, the tone to, to sustain without cutting it. Um, so uh, again, uh, perhaps not your obvious David Gilmore pedal, but one that you should definitely try, especially if you're into the uh, 80s uh, and, and also the 90s era of, uh, of, of Gilmore or, or music in, in general. So it's a fantastic sounding pedal and um, both as a boost and as a dedicated distortion. So, uh, as usual, I'm going to show you some of my favorite uh, tones. Uh, I'm using my black strat into the uh, Reeves uh, with the uh, Laney Lionheart cabinet with the uh, Celestians. And uh, I'm going to do a bit of 80s uh, Gilmore, adding a bit of chorus and delay. And I'm also going to, uh, to show you how aggressive this pedal is using an SG and doing some really cool uh, power chords. Please drop me a line in the comments field below. Let me know what you think about this video. Do you have the BLD? Do you have any other past effects pedals? And what's your favorite uh, 80s era David Gilmore tone or solo? Let me know. And uh, if you haven't, head on over to, uh, to gilmorish.com, check out uh, all the gear guides on uh, all the pedals, all the guitars, all the amps used on all the tours and all the albums. And also be sure to check out the buyer's gear guide uh, and for this video check out the overdrive and distortion uh, guide for some tips on how to set up your amp with different, uh, different pedals. Okay, I'll see you soon.